internet and welcome to today's video. I'm so excited because I'm doing a room tour, but before we get to that, I also have some very exciting news. I don't know if you guys noticed, but I'm wearing a shirt that has my username on it. What the heck? How did this happen? Anyway, I'm wearing a shirt that says Mini Lucy. I'm so excited. I can't believe this is actually like a real shirt. If you guys didn't know, I designed a skirt with Mode a few months ago. I'm actually expanding my line on minilucy.com with Formosa Labs, and I'm so excited to finally tell you guys about this. These shirts are not on the market yet, but if you guys want them to be, let me know in the comments down below and we can sell them. So if you guys do want these shirts on the market, make sure to comment down below because your comments are very important in the decision process. With Formosa Labs, I'm also looking to start my own candle line, which is absolutely insane because you guys know how much I love candles and I literally have them all around my room, which you're going to see in this room tour. This candle line, we would either be selling individual tea lights, six-pack tea lights, or full-sized candles. So if you guys are interested in me selling candles, please let me know in the comments down below because we need to know if you guys are actually interested and if you'd be willing to buy it. Also, if you're interested in candles, please let me know which sizes would be your favorite or which scents you prefer because we are very curious as to what you guys would like. As for prices, if I did sell candles, it would be around $1 for tea light candles or $15 to $20 for a regular sized candle. If we get enough feedback on if you guys want candles or apparel, we can launch them in mid-February, so that's very exciting. We really do need your help with this and I just can't wait to hear what you guys think. And also, just to show you guys, this is another t-shirt in blue and we could do a bunch of different colors, so just let me know. I just can't wait to see what you guys are saying. Anyway, today's video is a room tour and this has been so requested by all of you and since I moved in August I finally had a chance to finish my room and I'm so happy with how it looks right now I love color and all that kind of stuff so hopefully you guys will enjoy it and maybe get some inspiration for your own room so I think that's all I have to say for this intro sorry if I rambled on a little bit and let's go ahead and get started So starting out with my entire room as a whole, I just thought I'd give you a little overview so you know what the basis of my room looks like. And it does look a little cluttered, but that's just real life. Anyway, on the left side of my room, we have these three mirrors from Kirkland Home, and I think they add so much to my room for just little accent pieces. And then we have my bed, which is obviously the most comfortable part of my entire room and on my bed I just like to keep some blankets and also some pillows I love accent pillows so I have the smiley face one it was a gift given to me by my uncle and then I have all the other pillows from Ikea and then we have my headboard which is a white one with some little jewels on it and I wish I could tell you where this was from but I honestly don't know because it was a gift given to me but you can find headboards like this at Wayfair or all over the place. So above my bed I have this shelf from Kirkland Home as well and I keep a Polaroid chain on here just to add a little bit of decor with some clothespins and I absolutely love it. And on top of the shelf I keep some room decor that I've made in the past. These are in other videos if you guys want to check those out. And I just keep little knickknacks up here, some EOS lip balms because they're colorful. And then I have my 100,000 subscriber plaque which reminds me of you guys whenever I look at it and it just makes me so happy and I love it so much. Next to my bed, I keep a nightstand here to hold random stuff, and I think I got this one from Marshalls, so you guys can check there if you find it. And then on top of my nightstand, I keep some books. I keep my devotion book and also some other books that I like to read to keep them on hand. And I also have a clock and some little knickknacks over here. I have a little succulent. It's fake from Target and a Bath and Body Works candle. Next to my nightstand, we have one of my favorite parts of my whole room, which are these two tall white shelves. I actually painted these when I moved because they used to be brown, and I just love keeping room decor in here. So on the top shelves, I just keep a bunch of books because I just love having books in my room. It gives like a nice vibe, and also I like to read them sometimes. And then on the shelf below it, I have some more books and a little Ikea plant, and I also keep my Polaroid and some random little knickknacks in here, some room decor, box water because honestly it's really aesthetic and then below that I have my candle pyramid which proves to you guys that I am literally obsessed with candles so you know that just speaks for itself and next to that I keep some more little candles of course and some perfume jewelry and a mini clipboard to add a pop of color 
Then below that, I keep this really pretty book that my best YouTube friend Sydney gave to me. It says 88 Love Life, and it just has some really good life quotes in there. And then I have this nail polish rack to hold all my nail polish that I've accumulated over the years. It's kind of excessive, I know, so I just thought this was a good way to keep it organized. And that's pretty much it for my shelves. So next to my shelves, I keep my ukulele here. If you guys didn't know, I love playing the ukulele. Let me know if you want some ukulele videos, because I'd be happy to do that. And then I also keep this keyboard here that my grandma actually just gave me and I'm trying to get back into piano play that a lot and I just love playing instruments so then moving on to my desk which is next to my instruments I have this white desk and I like to keep some colored pencils and this really colorful Dylan's candy bar lollipop that I got in New York and my vlog camera and behind that I like to keep a white pegboard here because I love the look of pegboards and they're really easy to hang stuff on and I have this super cute tassel garland with a bunch of different colors that I got from Etsy I'm going to try to link their shop down below. And then I also have this little cute decor that says you make my heart happy and my essential oil diffuser on the other side. Above my pegboard, I like to keep this cute little gold reindeer head that I got from Urban Outfitters. And sometimes I like to hang my jewelry on there. And on my desk, I keep my computer and I do a lot of DIYs on there. Next to my desk, I have this IKEA organizer. You might have seen the vlog where I put it together. But on top of that, I have a record player and some records. And in the drawers, I just keep a bunch of makeup and beauty supplies and all that kind of stuff. And then we have my dresser, which is from Ikea, and it does look a little dirty from all the previous DIYs I've done on there, but I keep, obviously, my clothes in there, and I just have this really pretty painting sitting on top of it, and also a speaker, some random knickknacks. I keep saying that word, but it's true. And then next to my dresser, I have this really cute wall mirror. I'm going to try to link it down below. It's from Wayfair, and to add some more color, because as you can tell, I'm obsessed with pops of color, I added on some cute Target pink lantern lights and this is one of my favorite parts of my room and that brings us to the end of my room tour I really hope you guys enjoyed it and let's go on to the outro so that was it for today's video I really hope you guys enjoyed it please make sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below it seriously means the world to me when you guys subscribe and I just can't wait to keep on growing our so family please remember to comment down below if you're interested in candles or apparel or really anything like that because we need to know your opinions so I think that's all I have to say for this video thank you guys so much again for watching I love you so much and I'll talk to you in my next video